hello and welcome to my channel this is joy from she speaks to make sure you like make sure you comment and make sure you subscribe um, we are fresh off the heels of miss liberia it's the next day and we promised sienna and her friend that we were going to be going to oceans 11 which is the new resort off of 11th street in sinker so we're gonna um, pick our friend up then we're gonna go there and i'm going to try to vlog as much as possible <laughs> okay oceans 11 is a new resort indoor resort they have a swimming pool um they have an indoor playground they have people they have they say they have people to watch your kids like nannies there things like that so we're gonna check it out because we need to have more um family friendly places for children in liberia so i'm, I'm excited I'm excited and we are headed that way right, right now. Right now. Okay. Y'all know I had to do a little bit of driving and show you guys Monrovia. To the left coming up is the Calabash, which has now become one of the hottest places to hang out. I will go there and do a review pretty soon. Here we are at Ocean 11. I do realize that I've been saying Ocean's 11 this whole time, adding S. So the menus are trace and color for kids. I think at an establishment like this, they should give us crayons, just like any other place. Give us crayons and keep the kids busy while we wait on our food. So the girls got french fries and pizza, and then we got these little fried or baked uh, meatball type dish to the left. I think it's Middle Eastern or Mediterranean. Um, I definitely needed more because me and him shared and I did not feel full afterwards. But they tasted good. So Sienna and her little friend are going. <laughs> and um, they are so excited. So just to add, this play area is not free. It is $10 per child. I thought it was free too. Mm -hmm. They did have a lot of fun. Um, so we stepped away and decided to walk around to the pool area. Here's their little sporting area where you can play some games and then we walked over to the pool area. Beautiful view, we sat right by the ocean. Um, just breathtaking actually. Stay tuned and I'll tell you what I thought about Ocean Eleven. Okay, so I'm going to talk about the pros and the cons of Ocean Eleven. What I really like that it is kid friendly. They have a place to um, for kids to play. Um, I think we need a lot more of those in Liberia. But what I didn't like the price. It was ten dollars for the child to play. And also, when you drop your child off there, there is no accountability. There's no sign-in sheet. You don't show ID. Um, and then you just come back and you pick your child up. There are people there to watch your child. But I asked the girl, so if I come here and say, that child is mine, how will you know? And she said, oh, ma, I know. She said, anybody that kind of bring that child can look at the end, they can look at the child. I was like, there are 10 children here. You're trying to tell me you look at all of them? She said, yeah, I can look. I said, this is not a good system. I'm just telling you this is something to recommend to your boss that you at least have a sign-in sheet or name tags or things that match the parent. So guess what? When I came back to pick up Sienna, the same girl wasn't even there. So somebody else was there. Um, that didn't even know me but allowed me to pick up Sienna and her friend. So I'm just saying that I know kidnapping children are not a big deal in Liberia 
or maybe it is back in my day they had high men but um so that was one thing that i didn't like i didn't like the price ten dollars per child so we paid twenty dollars um maybe it should be like seven dollars or five dollars but i do understand everybody needs to make their money um i did like the pool area um it was very it's a nice area to sit down to have um to have dinner you know you can go swimming things like that what i didn't like what you didn't see is when we sat in the pool area um, my husband ordered cheesecake and the cheesecake was expensive and when it brought it basically it was frozen cheesecake that they had thawed out and the reason why i knew that was because there was still in ice there was still ice in parts of the cheesecake so if i'm paying that much money uh, i don't need to have thawed out cheesecake if you don't know how to make cheesecake then that should take it off your menu so that was one thing um, but I do like when we sat outside we sat by the ocean it was beautiful scenery um, and so those are the pros the pros is pros are that we like the place it's a nice place to go a nice place to take children cons the cost of the children's play area the fact that there's no accountability you just drop your child off you come back um, you may get your child you may get somebody else's child it's up to you um, con is I didn't like that you serving frozen cheesecake for that price if not just take cheesecake off your menu um, but I do like that we have a place for children to play we need more places like that because honestly I run out of ideas and places to take Sienna so that is a, a pro so overall I would give it a 7 7.5 out of 10 I would go back I may even think about having Sienna's birthday party there um, let's say if I took 10 children 5 to 10 children what would be the cost um, if it's something that based on the amount of children you get a discount I could definitely see myself having a birthday party there because you birthday parties in Liberia are very expensive because you got to feed the adult you got to feed the children you got to have liquor for the adults it, it turns into a, a adult party so this way maybe it's more cost effective let's say if it's 200 or so to have the party there we bring our own cake I could do that so I will go back um, we'll take her swimming there I may even go swimming there you know so this is a joy from she speaks Too. make sure you like make sure you comment make sure you subscribe and I will see you later